So now Petit Papa this, as they call a nickname, Petit Papa. When I hear, wait till we go talk. So I don't come out, I don't tell when I say the good shall prevail over the bad and the the ugly. We already finished with the bad, Michel Bienton. Make we go for the ugly now. Petit Papa, Ebenezer Akwanga. When I hear something. Um, good afternoon. I am in a car. When I hear. You see. I am in the car. <laughs> oh, nge. So for ye, Ambazonia then over so poor, so inferior, where when the sister you be in a car, it means something. It comes, she don't have a car now for make video too for car, say it's a car. You know how, how early some of us buy cars, Ebenezer Akwanga, some of us were driving back home. You understand? So, these are people who think less of you, Ambazonia. They think you don't have brain to think for yourself. They think you, you, are, you are so stuck in this colonial mentality that they can manipulate you anyhow. Listen to Ebenezer Akwanga shamelessly praise a genocider in front of your own eye and then they will come and expect you to still believe them so that they can manipulate you. They will still come and expect you to give them access to your ear to still manipulate you. Listen to this guy. And I've been wrestling after reading um, a statement that has been posted in French and English in which um, someone is trying to accuse the, is talking about a phone call or whatever between uh, La Republique's director of external res research, Maxime Eko Eko, and a certain Michel Bienton. And I have been so infuriated. There are times that when you see some of these things, you ask yourself. So, Ebenezer Kwanga, he be so infuriated. Say, there are exposed an audio where the show say, Michel Bientong, he did work with that echo, echo way be the column every day. So, now he way the vex. That audio said, you know, even concern me. Or the right of, I know everyone even play them or even mention them. Because for me, I'm wasting time. Michel Bienton, a francophone, he's supposed to work for a country, so he be normal, the kind of way they do him. But anyway, when I hear, when I hear Ebenezer Kwanga Petit Papa, when I hear he. For Christ's sake, Lord, why did you make me to be born in this land with this type of people, this type of individuals who, in fact, they really don't care about their own humanity and the suffering of their people? So, they want a petit papa. It is eating less of Ambazonian. If he say Ambazonian them, they need to think about the suffering of their people. That's one that quote for speak the enemy's language. For sure, when I say, we would fight, we would suffer and have to suffer for our own self. Now, the logic of the enemy, when they punish slaves them, say, do not revolt because you have to be punished more. Now the logic that Naida and Ebenezer Akwanga that they talk now like a colonialist apologist. When I hear, shocking, but it never shocked me because I don't see it before. I, I, I really don't get it. I don't get it. At times, I really want to believe what Comrade Carson Anyangwe used to say, our people are cursed. But I think this is more than being cursed. So this one are the kind type of corny when it don't go join hand with the enemy, meet up them for instance, hotel them for America. It come now for type of picks on one or two word them way in frustration. Doctor Carson Anyangwe when na a hero, he talk him. Say I'm basing that big curse. He want use that one for blackmail and also for discourage our people them. For think me them think less of themselves, me them be inferior in their own eyes. Why would he quote that, make that quote that Ambazonians are cursed? No. Dr. Carson Anyangwe knows that Ambazonians are worth his life. That's why he gave up the opportunity to become minister. He could be going around begging money like his, uh, his, his partner that started fighting with him, uh, uh, Simon Munso. He could be a minister back home. He was given the tax to help write the constitution. But he refused bribery and corruption. He's a decent man. 
who have stood sure, dedicated all his life to make sure that he brings justice to our people. Working with people like me, young people of my age, that people in and that mentality of big manism back home will not associate with people of that stage. Despite the injection by Ajahn provocateurs of insult, denigration, scandal within the struggle, he didn't run away. But he stayed there. When we're crying in the midst of, the, of, of death being caused by Sako county by county, there was no elderly man to speak except him. Cast an way things better of Amazonians. And there is no way somebody like Petit Papa, who have no shame, should bring that up. Now listen. It's more than being cursed. We are definitely, something is definitely wrong with us. There is nothing wrong with us, people of Southern Cameroon. Yes, we have gone through hard times. We have gone through assimilation. Our people are confused because of their state of mind coming through this process. That's why we spend our time doing emancipation. We don't spend our time in Switzerland receiving money from our NGO, going to ask for compensation while the people are still suffering. Where we are is worse than what you will find a madman in the street do. Maxim Eko Eko is the director of external research for La Republic du Cameroon, which means he has a job to do. Let you and me agree that there is a phone call where he is walking through that phone call to destabilize maybe ADF or um, one of the IG factions. Is that not his job? Between you and me, is that not his job? Let us agree that he's doing that. Is that not his job? So this this video be so it just be so hard for me for listen to be Ebenezer Kwanga. I will not even play it further. Ebenezer Kwanga make a no kongda in nose. Say na echo echo a job for picking key picking them for picking promote genocide. A co a co is a terrorist. Now a crime a co defender with Mr. Pobia for ICJ for the war crimes being committed in Amazonia for kidnapping of Seseko Ayoktabi. These are the people who plot for, to kidnap Seseko. Ebenezer Kwanga, you are saying he's doing his job. Is the job of anybody in the world to kidnap people to rendition them across border? This is the same man Ebenezer Kwanga said that he was the one responsible, his office was responsible to try to assassinate him, Ebenezer Kwanga. Is the job of a court a court to assassinate people? Is assassination the right word? He even go as far as oh God. To say that a court a court is a good man. He's just doing his job. Oh woo, 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 woo. now the same man this way but he can't convince you for China. Say Ambazonia be worth fighting for. Maybe we buy AK. Maybe we'll go through the pain of war at the end. It will be better for our next generation. Today, it can't call that pain we will go through. Saying I suffer, we will no need to go through. Maybe we'll remain for slavery with La Republic. Me the blood of even General Ngoy. Where you go, hey, believe he, follow he. Me go for water. Now the same person this is talking now also, say La Republic, them, they're not good people. The worst in the corner, terrorists. They call a corner, terrorists. Say a good man. Even their own francophone them, they go for your office for go protest. They say these are the people killing other black people. You, you, make I not lose my call for describe the one. Call I'm saying a good man doing his job. What job? Job is to kill children, to order the assassination of dissident. Refugee people are protected under international human rights war. These are people who have no dignity. No humanity. These are animals. These people, Eko, Eko, Bankoi, are dogs. Pobia is a madman. He's a psychopath. He does not deserve a handshake from any man who is a gentleman. Call them, they are doing their job. Nonsense. Stupid idiot like you. You go and call people to go and fight and die for a war, and you don't ha you don't have the decency to to back them up morally. You come and call terrorists that they are doing their job. What part in the Cameroon Constitution authorizes their president to use 
terrorism tactics against our people to burn down our village for you to say they are doing their job what part in that constitution or in any law in humanity that authorizes a court, a court to come and assassinate you in Nigeria maybe it is that sodomy that they give you in prison that is worrying your head madman madman like you idiot you are a shame Ebenezer Kwanga, you are a shame to General Ngoi, who died fighting under Sokadev. You came and you even tried to, to, to spoil the name of uh, General Cross and I, saying that we are not giving good instructions to General. How can a general go to a, 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 a funeral? Forget to know that your own Sokadev were burning people alive, closing the door of a church, took ransom from a church from a pastor under false pretense, and you participated in it. Today, because they have gone to use you there in, in, in Ghana to go and try to deceive the people in upper vote upper voter, the go cause of Ghana who are fighting for cessation there, they are using you, going there to give humanitarian aid. You think that you are somebody. Your, your secretary general is there in China. You are calling him Dr. Ema. What doctor? He have what doctor degree? I know Dr. Ema that Dr. Ema, we, when I came here in Hong Kong, we were together in Hong, Chongqing Mansion here. People with, with uh, Bonamosa degree. You are carrying, carrying them everywhere. Dr. Emma, who is Dr. Emma in China? When we were calling conference to fight for Ambazonia, that was the guy who was focused in doing business, selling t shirt to us for, for exorbitant profit. In the conference, he was just at, at the back. You, you come around, you look everybody, you go and pick only that one. Because you know he's a greedy man. Receiving money from refugees that you bring them to... Uh, to this man, Ambazonia, thank God that you have Ayabacho. Thank God that you have the good and the good have prevailed. Believe in the leadership of the governing council. The retreat was to save Ambazonia and it is saving Ambazonia. You have now the Canadians have had a meeting with the SCN, CDN, the Irish people and the whole world is coming to realize that they have to intervene. That it was a lie that Ambazonians are divided. The real Ambazonian leaders have been have met them and they have seen that we are we are united for the goal of our country, including the Federalists, the Unionists have have considered that this is what the people want. We are there to unite the people for a common cause. You have seen the presentation by yourself, judge for yourself. We have prevailed. So ladies and gentlemen, every good thing comes to an end. So we have come to the end of this program. But what I want you to know is that fight in there. Do not give up on our people. These are good people. You have seen the video we played of the man, young man, the, the, the how do they call that she in, in Bui, singing and crying. Oh, Saudun Cameroon have been sold. Oh, Saudun Cameroon have been sold. From CDC to Cameroon Bank. Oh, CDC shall not be sold. GCE board, where are you? Our elections for SDF, where are you? Where is our dignity, Southern Cameroon? Our own sister was killed, murder in cold blood in Boya. Mr. Pobia have gone to honor the killer. Oh, baby Mata, where are you? Bebe a big girl in Mauto, where are you? Oh, Ambazonian pastor who was killed because you hoist an Ambazonian flag saying that God told you that Southern Cameroon shall be free. Oh, baby Apie, oh, where are you? Bebe Caroline, oh, where are you? They came to Bui. They catch somebody for selling banga, some soya, and behead him that he is Amber boy. Samso Yao, where are you? Bebe Matao, where are you? They come to Bamenda in Old Town, arrest four youths who were going to read and prepare for GCE, killing them, putting Banga in their pocket. Oh, our children, oh, where are you? 400 village, oh, where are you? 900,000 refugees, oh, where are you? Our people are running and living in bushes. 
women, they don't even have power to clean themselves. Our dignity have been sold. Our life have been sold. Our land have been sold. My fellow country people, this is an existential struggle. Like Seseko Ebini said, there is no rich southern Cameroon when you look back home. There is no dignity and pride when you look back home. We must come together and fight a good fight to defeat La Republic du Cameroon out of southern Cameroon. God has given you a lion man in Dr. Cho Lucas Ayaba, the warrior who went to ground zero. He has fought a good fight on the ground. Sheikha V was with him. Benedict Kwao was with him. They brought you General Mba Ivo, Asawana Watana Wata. These are your heroes to save you. Don't be blind to see your Moses, O Southern Cameroon. May God bless you.